Boys, you can literally make millions of coins literally right now as I speak. This video is going out as soon as the update drops, and it is literally insane. Okay, this is the night before Team of the Year drops, okay? Team of the Year has Team of the Year challenges you're going to get a free 98 from. I'm pretty sure it's going to be B&D, so we're not going to worry about that. I'm not sure. This is, the, like I said, this is the night before. I'm really hyped for this because I know for a matter of fact, you can at least make $2.5 million today. At the bare minimum, $2.5 million coins today. I'm gonna go exactly over what we can be doing. I don't know how much the team of the, I don't know how much the TVPs are gonna be today. Again, this is being recorded the night before. Reveals are still going on as we speak. All I've saw is the defense. All I've saw, saw is the special teams. You know, we've got some Jalen Ramsey. I'm not going over the cards. That's for someone else to do. But we have a quick video that I know you can be doing right now to make millions of coins. I swear to God. So basically. Let's go ahead and head over to our challenges. Of course, like I said, there's going to be team of the week or team of the year challenges. And, you know, you're going to get a free 98 from that. Whether it's B&D or not, if it's not B&D, you can make double what I just said. You can make at least 5 million coins. If it is B&D, go ahead and put it on your team. Be, be happy. So go ahead. Do your team of the year. Obviously, Seasons um, is also coming out. We got that Calvin Johnson 99. We got that Trevon uh, 99, basically. So. Make sure you are, you know, grinding your season, your field pass. It's going to be really, really, it's a really good field pass. But the point of today is if you head over to Team of the Week and you scroll all the way down to your 54 challenges, there is how many weeks? There's 18 weeks. All you need is 17 to do the Team of the Year uh, fantasy pack, whatever. In sets right now is there's going to be a Team of the Year um fantasy pack you're going to get to pick any of the 98s and all you have to have is 17 team of the year tokens or team of the week tokens so you have to have 17 tokens meaning you have to do like what 17 weeks of this now you may question okay i do 17 weeks i sell my card for 500k where's the other 2.5 million or 2 million or wherever i'm coming from the reason you're going to be able to make 3 million is because if you just do it on another account make five accounts which is, I think is the max. If someone can find an exploit around that, it's whatever. I just want to uh, tell you, you may have a chance of getting banned. I just have to tell everyone that just in case you do get banned. You can't blame it on me. Um, anyway, all you have to do is go over to sets. Again, it's not in the game right now because I'm recording this night before. Anyway, it's going to be in there. They literally revealed the set. It's an auctionable 98 overall. You're going to go. You're going to go to program. You're going to go team of the year. And you're going to be able to make it for 17 tokens. Now, if we actually head over to my items, I don't know how many is actually obtainable, how many tokens you can actually get. It may be 17. It may be 18. I'm not sure. You might not have to do all of the challenges, but you're going to have to do a lot of them. So we go into Team of the Week. I have 25 Team of the Week, so we get, uh, let's just look at uh, newest, I guess. If we look at these, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So... Each week is going to give you one token. So you have to do 17 weeks, and you're going to go ahead and be able to get 600,000 coins. If you do 51 challenges, you're going to be able to get a total of two. No, well, technically, if you do 50 challenges, you do your 51 um, Team of the Week challenges, you're going to get 17 tokens. You're going to be able to put it in to the Team of the Year, and therefore, you're going to be able to make a 98 overall. You're going to be able to sell it off and then trade it over to your main account. I'm going to do this on all my accounts. If I can find a way to exploit the system to get 7, 8, 9, 10, 20 accounts, if I can get more than 5 accounts, I am doing it on every single one of my accounts. I'm doing it on 20, 30, 40, 50 accounts. But make sure you are doing this. This is no risk. There is no way you lose from this. So go ahead, do 17 weeks of challenges. These challenges are so simple. Look at these. Like If we go in, score a touchdown this drive. Gain 60 yards this drive. Don't allow a touchdown this drive. They're so simple. You're going to get a collectible for every week you do. You need 17, and you can go ahead and make a 98. Sell it. Get 600, 700, however much they're going for. I'm not sure how much they're going to go for. I think they're going to go for, like, I mean, obviously, you know, if you literally just go look, they're going for, like, 630K. They'll probably go down in the next few days. I say it'll take them a few days, but go ahead. Do this. It's such free profit. If these sell for 600K, you're going to be able to make, like, 3 mil. If these sell for 500K, you're going to be able to make like 2.5, 2.4. Do this right now. No risk, guaranteed, 100% profit. I'm going to be doing it. And by the end of tomorrow, I am going to have at least two mil, at least two mil. So make sure you're doing this. This is a really short video. 
I just want to get this out here because I saw that set and we thought they were going to be D- B and D. We thought those 98s were going to be B and D. And then they said auctionable. And we're like, hold on, what? These should not be auctionable. Now, also, I want to talk about TVPs. Now, depending on how much TVPs are in the store, we want them to be crazy expensive. Hear me out. We want TVPs to be 20,000 training. It might sound stupid. Obviously, you know how much it is, but we wanted TVPs to be 20,000 training because the higher the TVP is, the market will like, the market will push the price of the TVPs like a certain way. So if the TVP is 12,000, the market is going to like anchor out to like three per. So it costs 30,000 coins. TVPs are going to be at like 30,000 coins at all times. So if we have a training variety pack, that is 20,000 training, the market anchors out to um, 30,000 coins in that CVP, meaning market would be like 1.6, 1.7. The point is, CVP would be 30,000 coins, 20,000 training. You can get training at like 1.4. It'll keep the market low. We want the market to stay as low as possible so we can pick up teams. We can buy teams. We can actually play the game without like having to worry about training values and all that stuff going up and down. I don't know how long the TVP is going to be in the store. They have not released that. I'm sure you can see it as 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 I'm speaking. But um, obviously, I think the same things. Uh, team of the year will not be in TVPs. Obviously, there's no LCDs. For team of the year, we got like what 28 cards. Um, we got like nine honorable mentions, two uh special cards. We got a Micah Parson. We got a ton of different cards. That's not what I'm going over. Also, make sure you're sniping when TVPs do come out. Remember, if you go to TVP right now and we're seeing that Ultimate Legends are in the TVPs, make sure you're sniping those Ultimate Legends. You could maybe get them for cheaper training value. You could maybe sell them for higher, but ultimately, you want to get your cheap training or your training as cheap as possible. It's already too late, of course, as this video is going to go up very, very late. But, you know, just go ahead. Make sure you are doing those um, challenges. Also do the team of the year challenges. If it is auctionable, make sure you're doing that. You're going to be able to get like 5 million because you can do that on five accounts, 2.5 million. Do the team of the week on five accounts, give 2.5 million, 5 million combined. But if the team of the year challenges are going to give you a B and D, just go ahead and do it on one account. You can maybe do it on two and you can just quick sell it. See where you're going to be at. Of course, make sure you're grinding your field pass. Field pass is going to give us really, really, really good um, really good what you call it really good cards we got a Calvin Johnson we got a Trevon Diggs but I'll probably be streaming later today like later later today I have school today I'm literally at school as this video is going up but boys make sure you're doing those um make sure you're doing those challenges it's 50 challenges it may take you an hour to two hours at max and you're making 500,000 coins and there is no risk in the method boys I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope this video did help you and I'll see you in the next one.